Hey guys, welcome back to my video series tutorial to learn bot framework using Python language. This tutorial we are going to learn middleware concept. So middleware is a small component. This guy is in between adapter and our bot. So what is the use of this middleware? Middleware is used for many purposes. For example, if you want to log the message in and flow, what is going on? what is bot responding that logic you know that information you want to log it we can add a logging middleware and write our logic like that there are so many purposes is there i'm just giving an example for logging if once you, your middleware is ready it has to attach to the adapter we can add n number of middleware this you know diagram I added only three we can add n number of middleware so once is added one adapter passed to that turn that activity to here middleware middleware whatever logic you return it will execute and it should call the next method once the next method is called if the second middleware is available the control transfer to the middleware 2 like that middleware 3 finally arrive to our bot if the next method is not called in case if any one of the middleware some logic you are written you shouldn't process further that time you shouldn't call the next method automatically the control skip here so it won't go to the second step so next method is very important to implement the middleware concept next okay finally array to your bot now your bot responds to the user that time again the control transfer through middleware so three in this diagram three two one it's it will transfer like that then finally arrive to our adapter and send to the user we'll see quick example how to implement the middleware i'm moving to visual studio code here i created one folder and uh, again the same code here there is no code changes whatever previously i used the activity handler the same code only used here also from here we are going to add the middleware i'm creating one file called middleware one dot file here i'm going to write our middleware middleware is available in the bot builder core so bot builder dot core import middleware and turn contacts is required i import that also so I'm writing my class called middleware one. So it should be derived from middleware. Sync, sync def function of on turn self and turn context sorry turn context. The third argument is waitable so next for that we have to import callback callable and waitable so typing import callable and waitable waitable so callable function callable first argument is turn context and uh, Final argument waitable. Waitable. We are now we are just printing the statement. It's calling properly or not. Printing statement means we have to call the send activity method to display that information in the emulator window. Hey, I am middleware one. Once it's done, we have to call the next method. Next save it go to main application here first we import this middleware middleware one create object and create object attach the bot adapter so bot adapter dot use bot adapter dot use and create the object 
that's it save now compile the application connect to the bot here you can see hey middleware one So first it will go to here, display the message middleware one. After that it will arrive to our bot logic here. Because first time we connected no. If I'm send the second message, hi. First it will go to the middleware. The message will display like that it will go. Okay. Next thing is if suppose just stop the application. Go to middleware. Now I'm not calling this function. Make sure no error. Yeah. Now run the application. You see what will happen. Now closed. Connect. Middleware one. Other message is not displaying. Even if you send other message, it won't display because we are not calling the next method. So control it. It won't transfer to our next component. Our middleware, our or our uh, bot. So make sure you always should call the next method and next one is a reverse order. Let's say I add one more to context in activity. Hey, I am just called after your bot. Save it. Make sure no error. Application run that. Yeah. Now go to middle uh, uh, emulator. We are connecting. Here you see middleware user bot. Finally it arrived. Okay. Now I am sending another message. So this time you see here we get the complete picture. We'll we'll uh, no we'll disable this feature. Uh, we we'll start the message. We are sending to the hello. Then it will hit the middleware component. Next, it's called the our bot. Our bot. We are just returning the statement. What our users send, we are returning. Okay. That's display here. Next, again it call transfer through middleware only. So next, it will hit the middleware. So middleware, we are again we are printing the message called after your bot. So that message it display. Okay, we can add the condition also. As I said, here we are disabling this feature. What we have to do? We have to check the condition. That's it. If turn context dot con activity dot type equal to activity types. So it's available in the schema. I have to import that also bot builder dot schema input activity types activity types message then do this that's it make sure no error now run the application close reconnect again See this time it won't display any message. Even component also it's not displaying because we are not calling the next method. If else case if you call this one else method then this you know this function get hit it will display. In the middle or only we are high, uh, you know we are uh, making the condition only the message only allowed to the next method. So if I am sending the message here now hello. This time. The condition is true. Activity type is message. It will come inside the middleware. It will display the whatever the things we have written. It display and transfer to the bot again. Back to bot to middleware and finally arrived our bot. Sorry, emulator. I hope you can understand that middleware concept. If any doubts or anything, please add in the comment section. I'll reply on that. Thanks to all. Bye. We'll meet. We'll meet in next tutorial.